So I was just like always stressing about having to pump at work and then, you know, just keeping up with my supply and it was, it was horrible. So this time I was determined to build up an actual like freezer stash, I guess you want to call it. a mobile order for Anna. For Anna. We are finishing it up right now. We shall see you at the window. Alright, thank you. Anna? Yeah. Oh, can you fill that up? Can, we want to? can you fill it up to the top? Um, it's a grande in a Vinci cup. So we can put a grande size in here and it's in a Vinci cup. Nothing you want? I always get it like that. I always make it for So it's a grande drink in a Vinci cup. Yeah, but she, she gets like extra foam so it can go all the way to the top. Um, give me a minute. I want to did you want like the extra foam? Yeah, and can you guys add extra coconut milk? Yeah, so usually more... when it is the grande and a venti, there'll be space, but I could do the extra ice on the foam for you. Just for future reference, that will be the gap. Extra foam. Extra foam. Yeah, extra foam. Yeah, extra foam. We can fix it for you. Yeah, but just no, no, no extra ice though. No extra ice? No, just no. extra foam? Just extra foam and then a little more uh, of the milk, the coconut milk. They always do that at this place. I wouldn't order it one the other time and I really wouldn't really shit. So they just didn't make it right here? They never want to do it the way it should be. I have no other problem. Well, welcome to today's YouTube video, guys. We have a stressful morning. We have Anna not getting her correct order at Starbucks, and now we're on our way. To Did you guys ever watch the show Alegrías y Rebujos <laughs> when you guys were kids? <laughs> Okay, we're going to a store called Alegrijes, which reminds me of that, that TV show. It's actually a novella, right? Yeah, it's a novella. It was a novella for kids. Uh, I used to watch it as a kid, so did Anna watch it. I have this boiling hot water thing between my legs. What? <laughs> oh shoot, why did you put it away? I, I'm feeding Ian on one hand and you give me the drink. The story reminds me of Mexico. It was like I'm a Mexico. <laughs> we crossed the board, we came to TJ real fast. Number one, but me and number two and that's Mickey. Is that even a one? I, I don't even, yeah, I think so. Well, there's a ton of piñatas everywhere, so we will probably find one. ¿Te gustan estos, Ari? Ari. ¿Te gustan estos? Minimos? These are way bigger, huh? Okay, so what we could do is get these and then there's only a little bit of boys. So we'll do just regular white ones for them. Yeah. Here being a super mom. Look at this. Okay, go because my arm is fucked. <laughs> so much excitement up in up that fridge. <laughs> we have we're moving, y'all. We're moving. And I'm taking out all her lechita out. <laughs> Damn it. Didn't this move pretty quick though? Huh? Shouldn't we move this like kind of fast? Yeah, but I need to see which one's the oldest one so we can put it at the bottom. Oh, okay. We made an exciting purchase the other day. When you get old, man, the shit you get excited about. Anna was like, go pick it up now, go pick it up now, go pick it up now, it's gonna be bought it. She wanted to have it here. We got it yesterday, but we couldn't use it to today. We're gonna have room here now. <laughs> I know. Damn, yeah. This is not even all of it, huh? No, there's still at the bottom. There's still a ton more at the bottom. <laughs> we still have a ton more. Those oh, crap, minutes. all this. It's just those two cajones And these two cajones are full of just milk. So are these the only ones you're gonna put in there? For now, yes, because I need to bag those. Oh, okay. Let me come and show you guys our exciting purchase. Yeah, spot. Stop it. Get some help. Oh, sorry. We got a freezer. We got a freezer. And we tested it out with the food. There it is, guys, all the storage. I can't believe she almost filled it up already to the top with all this milk. Wow. Look at all the, oh, there's still more milk in here? I left the, the ones. There's that, some down there too? I just left, I left the one that was the first one from March down there so that I can know to use that first. What about this one right here? Which one? There's one right there. And there's one down there. Yes, they're the ones from March. There's three blocks. There's that one and there's two more down there. Yeah, but look at all the storage we have now. I know. <laughs> Danger. Danger. 
Have you ever seen the movie Snakes on a Plane? Me, no. No? You guys seen that movie when it goes like, I'm tired of these damn snakes in this damn plane? I have had it with these motherfucking snakes on this motherfucking plane! That's how I feel right now, y'all. I'm so tired of these damn weeds in my damn yard. I literally just finished a few weeks ago getting rid of all the weeds. I spit it all down and it's like, you know, it's like they're like kicking me in the face, y'all. They just all came back. Look at this jungle we got going on over here. You see this right here? This is frustrating, annoying. So glad that we have the automatic vacuums here. I decided to just throw her entire plate on the ground. You haven't done that in a while. Something I, like that? I feel like she's done she was like a baby. Yeah. She just launched her entire thing. But these guys are going to kind of eat her all up. Man, dude, what's up with you? <laughs> We're not laughing. Oh, my oh, God. Look at that, she just keeps throwing food. Jesus Christ. A ver, están mirando la pinche situación. I know, what the fuck? Look at her hair. <laughs> she has full of her hair. <gasps> no, 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 no. No, 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 that's what I'm saying. Boy, the crap. <laughs> for real, man. Just finished recording a video for you guys. I think you really like this one, huh? Yeah. <laughs> you look happy. I'm just laughing at the fact that I don't, I'm not drinking any caffeine right now. And I'm not throwing these drinks away. So what are you doing? I'm taking out the ice so that I can drink these little by little. Well, I'll, I'll see if it even works. But I'm trying to take out the ice, so that's what I'm laughing at. <laughs> I can lie to you guys. Some of these drinks have me a little bit like, I feel like, I feel like caffeine on me. Oh, the sugar, one of the two. oh, the sugar. We usually don't drink this kind of stuff. This thing's having a little toll on me. But make sure you guys go watch that video. We actually enjoyed it. I was shockingly with some of these drinks, man. I was honestly shocked. It was crazy. He's like, then but it went so much. He's late. Why'd you put it like that? I feel like Ian might have the Lumelli gene, man. Look at his arms. Look, look at that, that cut from the shoulder to the bicep. Yeah, Ian? Okay. Okay. Why are you in there with pants? I'm just chilling with her. <laughs> <laughs> before in that last clip um, I have been storing a lot of milk so I'm gonna talk to you guys a little bit about it because I know a lot of people have questions about that about milk in general like storing it and so I'm just gonna go ahead and uh, put some of these away and then tell you guys a little bit about it so for one a lot of people have asked me what pump I use so <laughs> the oh. pump I use is that one I use the Spectra and then I feel like there's mixed feelings about that. A lot of people say that the Medela is better, but I think this one's better personally. This one does the job like what it's supposed to do in a short amount of time. So then the reason why I have so much milk stored is because right now I'm just on maternity leave. So I'm gonna go back to work. So I need extra milk for when I go back to work. And also, you know, as your baby girls, they eat more. What I did with Aria was I thought I had so much milk stored and I ended up not having enough. Like I literally had, basically, I think it was like when we started, when I went back to work, it lasted like a few weeks. And yeah, I think it was like a few weeks, a month the most, but I think that's pushing it. Yeah, a few weeks. And I was, so I was just like always stressing about having to pump at work 
and then you know just keeping up with my supply and it was it was horrible so this time i was determined to build up an actual like freezer stash i guess you want to call it this is a haka this is like a, a little manual pump so yeah it looks weird but this is a pump too so basically if you're breastfeeding obviously you're gonna feed your you're gonna feed on one side and then attach this to the other and then this is this collecting all some people do it for the letdown but this is also a pump so basically you're pumping out everything else and it's like a little suction so you don't have to have like an actual pump on you so that's what i would do from the start and then after maybe like basically right off the bat i think I, this was like a week later um just when my milk came in i just started pumping also so i would do the haka while feeding him and after i would still pump for at least like five minutes so then i just started storing it also like a lot of, of people always like ask like oh do you do anything specifically for your milk supply or anything like that and I thought when my first time around honestly that was like brand new to me so I was just having to figure it, things out on my own so that's where I messed up with not pumping like all as much as I did um, my first time what I was doing was I was still drinking all the water I was still doing everything and I was actually pumping way more often than what I'm doing right now but I honestly I don't even know what it was but I think basically pumping so I think having a good pump is is what what you need and obviously it's true what they what people say about the oatmeal these handy dandy cookies honestly for me they don't do just a fucking snack I don't see no but what I'm trying to say is that these they're good I don't see a major difference but my sister says that when she she um had them she can see the difference right away these i just started i think i i think at the beginning i started eating them also right yeah. yeah i right now it's like some days i do some days i don't i went like a month already without them so it doesn't really matter um i guess to help build up your supply a good idea the coconut i drink a oil. lot of water the body armors coconut water that's what i drink right now that's what i do i guess to help my supply is i just drink a lot of well, a lot of water in general coconut water body armors the oil oh oh yeah and i saw on <laughs> i saw on tiktok honestly i don't think that is working at all but i do it anyway just because i just include it into my diet i guess is a, like a tablespoon of coconut oil supposed to help i did i notice a difference no because it's supposed <laughs> to multiply your supply like crazy by the third day and my supply stay the same but you know um just add it in there just because it's good fats anyway i think it's crazy how last year you were or basically last year yeah, <laughs> two years ago you were taking like a bunch of pills oh, yes. a so bunch then, of stuff yeah. so then last year i got i was taking because my supply was pretty low. Like I was literally, I was barely making enough to to feed her. And you were then, you were instead of leaving by the check, paycheck to paycheck, you were leaving like pump to pump. I was leaving pump to pump <laughs> towards the end. And then you know, towards the end, it's not that important anymore because she was eating more food. But still, even even then, it was stressful. So you know, and stress lowers your milk supply. So it was horrible. Um, these I took all the time. Literally, we're already about to hit three months. I bought this. At the start and i said you know what i'm gonna get them because i know i had all that trouble before so i just bought them anyway and they're still here like sometimes i i do notice though for real though like try not to stress because your milk supply will go down i've been stressing if like when i stress out about like something major or whatever i do notice that it goes down and i'll just take i've taken it like maybe four times do i notice anything no i don't notice like oh wow it picked back up no but these i was swearing by these now they're just kind of chilling over here so these also i would drink literally one of these every day so these i would literally take one also two i would do two. i would make the tea for you in the morning i would do two packets oh he would give me two packets <laughs> did i know obviously i was struggling so those didn't make a difference either. yeah you're doing two packets of those. i need to put some of these milks away actually i need to hurry up hold on Yeah, just come inside our fridge with us. Well, it's not Nothing a fridge. Nothing milk. Oh, milk in here. So, like I was saying, those also, the milk, I would take those. I literally, I don't even think I've even had one of these. I opened it to have it ready to go. I don't think I have made you a tea or seen you drink a tea at all. I haven't. I think that's the box is complete. I just haven't used them. I just feel like... 
Maybe I'm just giving Anna less stress this time around. Maybe, maybe because you know you're new at everything before, so I was just. And you, you were the first one in your family to have a kid and yeah. breastfeed. Yeah. And kind of in my family too. Well, yeah, I'm like the younger people, like obviously parents and everything they did, but for like my cousins and like people I know, no, like I didn't know what I was doing. <laughs> All I know was that I started looking up some videos. Obviously, I didn't do the job right because I didn't really do the whole pupping thing right. All, all, all she knew was TikTok. TikTok wasn't back then. It was just YouTube. Really? I, didn't, I don't think I started using TikTok. Wait, when was already born? It was already pandemic. Yeah. No, I didn't get into TikTok like looking at that type of stuff till afterwards when it was too freaking late. Oh. But yeah, even the power pumping and everything, that, that doesn't work. Oh, for that's me. crazy. Yeah, you'll pump for like freaking 30 minutes. No, that power pumping is when you pump for an hour. An hour, yeah, something like and that. And that didn't work for me either. It was just a painful pain. hour. <laughs> well, no, it wasn't pain, but it's just a long ass hour, if anything. But yeah, so that's a little bit of that. So there, there's, I have a, I just look back and think of the supply I had with Aria was probably, it was less than what you guys saw in there right now. It was probably just, that little container and then some. And compared like, to what we have in the freezer in the And garage. then right now it's like, I'm just like, what was I thinking when I thought I had like the biggest amount? And then that's the reason why I, I remember I stopped pumping so much because I was like, oh, I, I have so much milk. And then it was gone in like two, a few weeks. I don't know how many exactly, but it was gone like so fast. With that being said, Thank you so much for watching the Little Mother Family. We appreciate you guys. We love you guys. And we'll see you guys in the next one. Bye. Who's washing all this shit? You are? <laughs> Dude, look at all these bottles, man. Why do I gotta wash all this? <laughs>